working as it had to be done, and I could contribute, I did, and was never sorry for having done it. The uranium gun weapon, or little boy bomb, was a simple design, and scientists were confident it would work without testing. The fat man, or implosion bomb, was a more efficient design, using plutonium instead of uranium. Inside the very center of the bomb was an initiator, surrounded by a sphere of plutonium. This sphere was encased within a set of symmetrically located high explosive lenses, creating an implosion which forced the plutonium into itself, attaining critical mass. blast instantly raised temperatures to 10 million degrees, releasing a force of a million pounds of pressure, vaporizing the tower and all desert life within a half a mile. The intensity of light was sufficient to cause temporary blindness to an observer 10 miles away. With a yield 200 times greater than the 100-ton test, the fireball created a crater nearly one half mile across and fused the desert sand into a green glass still containing traces of radioactivity 50 years later. the United States into war. For three years, gathering momentum with each small victory, our forces had conducted an offensive against the war bloated empire of the rising sun. Slowly, island by island, mile by mile, and then with ever quickening sweep, the combined land, sea, and air forces of the Allies drove against the borders of that empire, forcing it back until late in 1945, only the bastions of the Japanese home islands remained to be stormed. Ahead lay the greatest campaign of all, invasion of the Japanese homeland and close-in, desperate fighting. That this fanatical enemy would not quit until her last fighting man had been driven from his cave and killed had been established time and again by bitter experience.
the uranium gun weapon, or little boy bomb, was detonated over Hiroshima at an altitude of 1,800 feet, the height to achieve maximum blast effect. Three days later, the Fat Man implosion bomb was detonated over Nagasaki. In Hiroshima, 70,000 people were killed or listed as missing. Of its 90,000 buildings, over 60,000 were demolished. The implosion bomb dropped on Nagasaki took the lives of 42,000 people and injured 40,000 more. It destroyed 39% of all the buildings in the city. With a yield of 20 kilotons, similar to that of Trinity, this weapon would be considered a nominal atomic bomb and provide a blueprint for all future nuclear weapons.